Are you recording? All right. It says record. I'm not getting a picture, but are you not? It's recording. It's because the cap is on. I guess. Ah, Still that's a good record. Okay. okay. This is my acoustic double neck guitar that I'm taking to New Zealand. Yeah. Okay. Cool. So hopefully this guitar makes it to New Zealand, Auckland, New Zealand, in one piece. If not, I'm prepared to buy a cheap guitar. Single neck. Single neck. Honeysuckle, busy bumble in the air. Over trussle like a muscle, lazy fair. I don't care. Where beats wear in the snow. In the snow. Drumsticks, guitar chords cover my floor. This song symbolizes my first attempt to reinvent. My head's been out of phase. Out of phase. Voltage converter. Country music, simple music is now old. Same song everywhere that I go. Run to the store to buy more. I know. Hello, I'm Fast Heart Mart. I'm on tour to New Zealand right now. And gonna play some music over there. I'm gonna go to about six different towns in New Zealand, in the North Island and the South Island. We started our tour today from Albuquerque, New Mexico, where there was snow. And now we're in LA. There's a lot of cars behind me. We're in LA and we're waiting. We've been waiting since 1.30 today for somebody to come pick us up. I've been looking at footage of myself today, from today, and I realized a couple things. One is that my teeth really need to be fixed. This tooth right here in the front needs to be shorter. And it almost looks like it's in the middle of my mouth, so it looks like I have one big tooth coming out the front, which I never realized about myself before. And another thing is I need to be more exciting uh, when I'm walking around the world because I look like just another boring person. I mean, I should probably take off my hat, take off, take off these glasses, should probably take off the ponytail, and look like a rock star all the time. Just constantly be in rock star mode, you know? Rock stars. I mean, that's what I am, I'm a rock star. I drank a beer at 10 o'clock this morning, and I had a whiskey at 9.30. This morning, um, I haven't had any beer or whiskey since, but I am a rock star and I'm on a world tour to New Zealand with my drum playing girlfriend. Yo Robin, yo Robin, what are you doing over there? She's gonna be coming over here. So I had a, I had a, um, an epiphany today, Robin. This is our first day on the tour, right? This is it. And I had an epiphany just watching some of the earlier footage today. And that is, I need to look like a rock star all the time, 24-7. <laughs> sure. 
have brought your other shoes. These ones are good. These are not Rockstar shoes. Those are, those are the Vagabond Rockstar Neither are these. shoes. No, they're not. No. Robin and I are going to backpack this whole tour. From, we're dressed like backpackers, not rock stars. From the North yes. Island to the South Island. We're going to do Auckland. We're going to do Rotorua. We're going to do Wellington. That's only three, sorry. We're going to do Picton. Nelson, Golden Bay, Dunedin, Christchurch. That's six. That's the plan. Six. We're, but we're still we're still in the United States of America in LA today. We have about 26 hours. No, we have about 27 hours till our plane takes off for New Zealand. What will we do tonight in LA? We're looking for a date. Yes, we are. Yes, you are. I'm looking to get some sleep on the f in the bushes behind us here at Century Boulevard. Okay, I'm gonna open up this box after we went through customs and flew God who knows how many miles. 15,000 miles probably. But let's see if this guitar got broken. So far so good. The necks are not broken off. Body's all intact. Too ambitious. Should have just stayed home and drank beer. But chose to come out to New Zealand and play some music. What was I thinking? I'm so homesick. I, I'll go eat at McDonald's right now. Just to get a taste of home. Looks good. It's meant to be. Here we are on New Year's Eve in Auckland, New Zealand. We're gonna play a show. This will be our second street show. Second street performance here in Auckland. Let me show you what we're gonna play. As you, as you can see, it looks like any other place in the world, but notice the people are driving on the left, on the right side of their cars. I can't even figure out how to cross the street or turn on a 
the light. Everything's backwards. I'm gonna show you this. We're getting ready to check out at Kiwi International right now and go to Sam's house. Behind me is Queen Street. Our ride is here and we might get a car today. Here we are in front of Rion's car and we're going to try to get all our luggage out of it. It's stuffed in there pretty good. We have a lot of luggage. We're Definitely from the United States. Duh. Let's hope. We're in the white room. We need a black curtain. I don't normally drink this much beer. Just, just, uh, um, as you know, it's that time of the year. It's the holidays. How's that? We should take them out soon, actually. Beer. Uh, never having to work unless you want to. Um, being as creative as you want to for the rest of your life. Cheers. And drinking beer. <laughs> drinking nothing. <laughs> How's that cycle? <laughs> so, um, yeah guys, thanks so much. Uh, yeah, I'll just say really a couple of words to finish yeah. with. I was um, walking down Queen Street with my friends and we were pretty out of it and we came across Fast Heart Mart and um, it was synchronicity I think because it was such um, a refreshing sound that was um, resonating down the street and we were just drawn to it and the rest of the week's been great because we've been able to hang out and provide a space for the name of music and creativity and yeah I wish you well for the rest of your travels.
named her Old Blue for now. We don't want to really give her a name until she's proved herself worthy. I like Saloon. Saloon. <laughs> Saloon Blue is the name on the title. Makes you want to drink and drive. That's true. But uh, right now I'm going to jump start it. Or I'm going to push start it down this hill. And this road is not empty, but uh, it's not too busy. And I'm driving, I'm driving on the other side of the road here in New Zealand. Was I the last person to drive? Predicament. Place. So yeah. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna have to push it out. Okay. I don't know if I can do it by myself. Or not. I'll help you. Okay. So now I'm taking a right turn in a busy intersection, and I think I have to yield to anybody who's taking a left on that side. But right now there's nobody. But one easy thing about New Zealand is the pedestrians do not have the right of way. So, if somebody's in the road when it's green and I run them over accidentally, it's not, uh, I'm not liable. <laughs> and they have free health care, so. Yeah. They'll just get taken care of. And we don't have insurance, do we? Don't, we don't have to. That's right. You don't want to move that fast right there. Uh-oh. Ah. Here I go. I didn't yield to him. I have a green arrow. I think that's why. I think I'm okay. I was driving my car down the road when a little bitty bird hit my window. Oh no. Oh no. Too much traffic behind to stop I had to keep driving to the store Where I shop and the bird Kept hanging on To my wiper blades On my windshield Having fun It was no big deal as he sung This song I got out of my car to check on the bird I left my door ajar And he started talking to me He said, thank you sir for teaching me to fly My parents tried but they didn't know why I could not fly They must have seen you coming and they pushed me from the tree With the big limb hanging over the street now if they could just see me
This next song was featured on KFM 100 yesterday. I don't know if anybody listens to KFM here, but it's a radio station up on K Road. This is KFM 106.9. All the way from New Mexico, this is the Fast Heart Mart. About a society and working. Wicked. Okay, guys, thanks a lot, and um, we'll see you down at the uh, Dobbs Bullock. Thank you, thank you, Tim. Wicked. Thanks a lot, man. <laughs> yeah, there you have it. Our first interview here on KFM. This is our drive show. This next song is called The Rich Man. It's about a rich man who gives away all of his money to the poor people. <laughs> Bill Gates did it. He can give away all his money. Give away a lot of it. <laughs> That's what his publicist said. <laughs> he said it on the Oprah Winfrey show, so that must be true. <laughs> going to be able to get into and have a lovely mud bath. It turns out um, we have to stay behind protective fences. They're too hot to get in. But they're cool. <laughs> Stupid thing I fell into.
We're now in Wellington, where there's a lot of ships and a lot of water. And we can see the ocean. There's a lot of cars. Oh, hello again. We're now in Wellington. We drove from Rotorua to Wellington today. About a five and a half dro hour drive. Six and a half. About a five and a half hour drive straight. We didn't even stop at all. All we did was pee in the bushes one time. We got all the way to Wellington While today. a trucker watched. Yeah, while a trucker watched, but. When you gotta go, you gotta go. Now we've gotten to Wellington. We found a place to park our car at good old Jazz's house. Our new, our new roommate. Roommate here in Wellington. You're not. Cold call. Just did a cold call. Walked right up to his house. It's absolutely free. As far as I know. We'll see. We'll see how it goes. I know. But now we're we're uh, cooking food in our kitchen, and our bathroom is right behind us. It's actually a bathroom that's open from 9 in the morning till 9 at night. So the hours are good. And the place looks beautiful so far, huh Robin? We're having fun. We're having a good time. Cheers, Robin. Here's to plenty of money on the streets. And Rota Root. What is it? What? The name of the pub we're playing at? Bodega. Bodega. Big night at Bodega. We're eating breakfast in our car. We're camping in, in the car. This is the worst summer they've ever had. In Wellington? Mm-hmm. The rainiest summer? How's a street band supposed to make money now? I don't know. We don't even have enough money to get across on the ferry. I don't know. We'll figure something out. Do you have to act like that? Why don't you just act like yourself? You always get that look on your face when the camera gets on you. You get all dorky. I do? Yeah, you go. Okay. <laughs> <clears throat> if this is going to be a documentary, it can't be all like hemmed up, you know? Well, the thing is, Robin, we just said, we just had this conversation, so you said you wanted to put it on, you wanted to get some footage of it. Mm -hmm. So I thought we were acting now. <clears throat> no, the thing about acting is that people aren't supposed to know you're acting. Mm. Okay. You're supposed to, you're supposed to be depressed okay. about that, <clears throat> that fact that, <clears throat> like, like, oh no, you know, how are we going to make money? It's raining and, and we're a street band and, and our equipment's going to get wet and there's going to be nobody out walking around and 
we could just die in our car. Like, we could starve to death here in our car. You know? I mean, that's like... Yeah. Okay. That's drama. That's what okay. people want. They want drama. You gotta... Right. They want to see you, like, at the end of your rope. Remember that Metallica? Yeah. Um, documentary? Mm hmm How everyone just wanted to see him at the end of their rope? Yeah. <clears throat> okay. Okay, let's... I want to see you cry. Let's see you cry, Martin. Okay. And mean it. Okay. Sounds good, Robin. Thanks. <laughs> I guess we're gonna edit this part out. I'm trying to figure out turn this off. meal at this fancy you don't go up my nose 
We're getting an organic meal. Like, we get to use their phone and their internet for free. They'd probably let us sleep here if we asked. Should we tell them we're living in our car? Can we sleep on the dance floor? <laughs> This beer is the most expensive beer I've ever had. Hi. $27 for one. 9% alcohol. Very Looking good. Made by some monks in Germany. Belgium. I don't know the difference. What do you got there? Some vegan food. And they just whipped that up for you. Yeah. It wasn't on the menu. <laughs> Best cup of jasmine tea I ever had. Here it is. Dragon Eye Jasmine Pearls. So fragrant. So aromatic. Not bitter. If you could smell what I'm smelling. Funeral home. Don't drink out of a pint glass, drink out of a chalice when you're drinking Shema. <laughs> Shema, 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 Shema. Hokey dokey. I think, uh, I think we need to uh, get Batman Robin out from behind the curtains here. So for uh, anyone that's got their attention on me, can start chanting... Oh, fast Heart Mark. Fast Heart Mark. Give me my gets of action. Fast Heart Mark. Fast Heart Mark. Fast Heart What are you saying? Batman and Robin. <laughs> This first song is called Trust the Farm. Look at this. I got our poster up. Yay! It's always a good time. Best Art Mart's playing here. Wow. They suck. And it's also on a hill. We can park on a hill. <laughs>
Did you have a good time in Wellington? Wellington's great, I like it. Yeah. Reminds me of Albuquerque. It's a town of instant karma. Yeah. Uh, gossip. Um, everybody knows everybody. Yeah. And uh, it's like a big village instead of a city. Yeah. It also has my new favorite restaurant and my new favorite internet hotspot. There's cute little houses in the hills too like that. I'm really excited to get to Christchurch. Yeah. To see Lisa and the kids. Okay. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, let's play a show first, though. Okay. Okay. At the bar. Okay. On the ship. Yeah. Okay. Thank you.
motorbikes that I used to have to stop and get past the fire to help. <laughs> There's no loss, there's no work and no jobs No one's gonna drive me crazy <laughs> hardcore. You're hardcore. Hardcore. Hell yeah. No, it's really good. <laughs> Thanks. We are uh, well known in the United States, and some people do actually sit in the rain to watch us. And the US. Believe it or not. Our families. Our families sit in the rain to watch us. Oh, they the do. Yeah. Our mom once caught pneumonia sitting in the rain watching us. No, I'm just kidding. What do you think, Lisa? Is Jesse gonna win today? He'll be in the top ten. He'll be in the top ten. We're waiting for Jesse to race here at the Church Christ Church Speedway. Yeah. Ha <laughs> ha
are you two gonna be gothics when you when you're a teenager? No, no definitely not. Why not? Because uh, so we're black and I like colours. I like colours. <laughs> This time more feeling. Are you gonna oh, are you gonna fashion? Right, okay, let's start repeating those because it won't work if you edit. Yeah, Do you want me to speak in your accent or just English? Colors are in fashion. No, we're not. Fashion. Fashion. What do you think? <laughs> Georgie, how many kids are you gonna have when you grow up? None. None? Okay. A hundred. A hundred? <laughs> <laughs> Why a hundred? Yeah! A hundred? Uh. <laughs> Do that again. I'm not in the best state of mind. You're not in the best state of mind. You're what? Not in the best state of mind. Not in the best state of mind. No? You just got done singing all those songs. I'm gonna be the I'm gonna be the wreck day. I'm gonna be the wreck day. Wreck day. Living like snakes on the lonely young, we were living like fakes in a wax museum. We got monkey brains and a cranium, drinking things to eat a chicken wing. Thank you. Thank you. I didn't find out about this hill until about two days ago. This is why we were scared to take the car. Oh, it is? I thought we were scared to take the car because the clutch is slipping, it's overheating when you idle, and it won't start unless you push it. But it's because we thought that it would not make it over this hill because of those things. Oh. So how, how's it doing? Doing fine. Keep it nice and cool. Stuff. There's something coming very fast down this turn. Maybe it's just the wind. It's quite a hill. It is quite a hill.
and we're coming down now, trying not to stall. On our way to Golden Bay to play the Muscle Inn. Uh, oh, thanks. I can't mix it. I can't mix it with the beer. <laughs> this song's called Tin Girl. Architecture here. Here in Dunedin. Dunedin. Like, you know, there was like yeah. a good time going on. You know, yeah, it's good. 
an illusion, shall we? Yes, it's creative illusion. No, it is. We're having a good time. And then one's dancing. This song's called I Hate My Job. I know what 
the holiday really means I know what the holiday really means I know what the holiday really means What's your favorite dog? <laughs> What's your favorite color of blue? I've never seen a dog that had blue eyes before. That's brown. Oh, we'll give it some flavor. And a tail. I'm pretty sure it's an orange person. There's orange dogs in there, actually. Really? Probably. She's a reddish one. Brownish one. Get some film too. So do we. Yeah. We need some more video camera film. So it'll be another stop off, right? We're not going to get to Wanaka until like I freaking know. midnight. Five that's okay. Night. That's okay. Sure is, because we're driving back in the morning. And then we'll be leaving. Yeah, that's time. true. So we're going to be in Wanaka to sleep. <laughs> and we're going to drive back. Because Grandpa's <laughs> got to be here for Sunday night to do some school work. <laughs> and then you can't be late. It's got to be done by midnight. Five o'clock sharp. Yeah, who? <laughs> Let's go spend the night in Monica. And get back here bright and early. That should be fun. I'll go to the booger. I'll go to the booger. Oh, you don't know. I got a white booger. I know, right? That's what I'm saying. I got a white booger. Nasty. Okay, camera's had enough of you. Good point. Hi, Kramer. Do you want a piece of me? Come on. Man, he's really tough, bro. Okay, I'll keep, I'll call them there. Camera's okay, ignoring. I'll talk okay. to these guys. Camera's scared. Okay. Camera's scared. Okay, here's, a, here's another, another <laughs> option. On the roof. Twitter, another option. Uh, for 10 more dollars, we can get that hotel. <gasps> from. It's 2 o'clock, we're leaving. We're going to Wanaka. Woohoo! Yay! 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 Queenstown. Yay! 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 We're in a big like band. Or <laughs> more, more, more accurately, like a herd of turtles. Almost like a startled steak. <laughs> startled steak. Big van. We got a full tank of gas or diesel, I should say. Yes, we have to make sure it's full. We do it. Okay. Will that get us to the place in one tank of gas, or? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think so. Who has gum? The van mom. I just put some of them there. It's a five hour trip. <laughs> a five hour tour. Yeah. yeah, sure. This is the place where everyone has been telling us to go. Really? The whole time. And everybody in New Zealand? Yeah. Where did, who, for instance, who? Just everyone we talk to. When they say, Where have you been? We tell them where we've been. And then they say, You have to go to Wanaka. And what is that Wanaka? They said Another it's. Bit, uh, what, up rivers? They said oh. it's so beautiful. Gorgeous. Do you want to go use the restroom? Yeah. Let's speak up. I'm top one. Look at them look at them all milling around like ants. <laughs> what, are they, what are they doing? <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Check out this cool pad, man. What makes the refrigerator turn on? Where's everybody? Where's everybody staying? Well, we're staying in this room right here, sir. Where's we? Me, Martin, Dylan, and Robin. You're in that next one, right over there. Come on. Get out of here. Show him Orion. Show him Orion and your rain. Let me show you something. That sauce kind of weird here, too. It's Orion in his belt. <laughs> <laughs> Look at him.
11 o'clock at night and we're three hours away from Christchurch still. Make it have us. 1130. It's 11.30 at night and we're three <laughs> hours away from Christchurch almost out of diesel fuel in some little town on the west coast. than anything. Why? That I have to keep doing this every day. <laughs> it's not funny, Robin. Okay, that was Fast Heart Mart with a track called I Hate My Job and it's my pleasure to Welcome Mart and Rob Lynn. Rob Lynn? 
that's it into the studio. So thank you so much for both coming in. Thanks, Thanks for, for having, having us. us. It's all right. Now, um, oh, and I was also just as I was trolling through your info, I noticed that um, you have you made a comment um, about you prefer to play to smaller, intimate crowds because you don't like to play loudly. Because that's you, right. You say that. If you can't do it without electricity, it is unnecessary. Yeah. Where does that sort of ethos come from? Well, I just, um, I just think that um, the acoustic music, I don't know, it's just more raw. I, I think the end of the world is coming, basically. Right. And we're not going to have electricity, so I'm yeah. Get I'm used writing, to it, kind of thing. Yeah, and I'm writing music that can be for, performed without um, electricity, basically. Yeah. We're yeah. primarily a street band. Right. We play out on the sidewalk, we busk a lot, we enjoy playing um, over here during the Buskers Festival. Mm -hmm. Oh, right. That was neat. Yeah. Oh, good. But then again, you know, you kind of need electricity for your heart condition. That so, is true. Ooh. So, Ooh, got, got me on burned. that one. Got burned. <laughs> that's, the, that's the conundrum, yes. isn't it? Yeah, but, yeah, I agree. I mean, um, Bob Dylan had that controversy when he first played with mm, yeah. you know, electric guitar as well, so cool. Oh, and so you're playing tonight at Owl's Bar. What time will you be on? 9 p.m. sharp. Right, and is yeah. there a cover charge tonight? Five dollars. Five dollars. Very affordable, so yes. make sure you get down to check out Fast Heart Mart. Yeah, we'll be on from 9 to 10, and then uh, the Solar Vibes are coming on from 10 to 11. Yes, I'm going to be talking to them a bit later on. Yeah. Time around time. Cool. Okay, this is a track called Trust a Fire In from Fast Heart Mart. Thank you so much for coming in, guys. Thanks, Thanks Darlene. Darlene. It's all right. Okay, here it goes. Awesome. Yay. That was good. Thank you. Yeah, thanks for doing it. No problem. You're my first international interview, so it's exciting <laughs> for me. Rob, camera. Robin has now dyed her hair a strange color of red. <laughs> play a show here in Christchurch and we're gonna rock this crowd. This is our big show. We did two radio interviews today. We flyered everywhere. We promoted it for two weeks now. And here it is the big show. What do you think about Fast Heart Mart? They're fine. How do you feel about Fast Heart Mart there? How do I feel? Do you like them? Or do you think they suck? He's a bit of a dodgy character. And I have some of the light days, she's a bit dodgy as well. Oh, yeah, I'm recording you. <laughs> I know, I'm cheating on the white couple. Who are you guys here to see tonight? Um, my cousin. What's his name? Who are you guys here to see tonight? I'm here to see Fast Heart Mart. That's good, that's cool. Who are you here to see? I'm, I'm here to see Fast Heart Mart. <laughs> Alright. Who are you here to see tonight? Who are you here to see? I'm not sure. You. Yeah. <laughs> Fast Heart Mart. That's right, that's right. Who are you here to see tonight? Huh? Who are you here to see? Fast Heart Mart. You're here to see Fast Heart Mart? That's good. Oh, there he is. Coming over here. Thanks. Why are you here? Who are you to here to see? To see your um, uncle, Martin. Hey? Oh, fast heart, Matt. Uh, solar vibe sounds pretty cool. Um, I'm gonna need a cord for this mic. This, I don't know how it got disconnected. Um, uh, don't worry. Well, It'll be soon. Don't worry. Okay. We'll do everything in order. We gotta tell Mark. That's show business. What are you guys here to see? Fast Art Mart. You're here to see Fast Art Mart? How about you? Yeah, okay. Fast Art Mart? Alright, that's sweet. Who are you here to see tonight? Matt. Who are you tonight? Fast Art Mart. Alright. Who are you here to see tonight, sir? Travis. Alright. The Mayans have predicted that the end of the world will be here in 2012. But it'll be a good time. Gonna get away. Nobody's gonna get hurt, nobody's gonna die. The world is just gonna end. And we'll be much happier then. This song is called 
the Mayan prophecy. You got a pretty good deal? Uh, I hope so. If it lasts till tomorrow, then. <laughs> <laughs> It'll last till tomorrow, that's for sure. New Zealand has a lot of backward stuff. Come here and I'll show you. Okay, here's one, one really weird thing about New Zealand. The light switches are backwards. This is off, this is on. Off, on, off, on. On, off. Weird. They all do that here. Now, if you're wondering if the toilet bowl flushes backwards in New Zealand, we'll find out. Watch this. Here's a weird thing about New Zealand, too. All toilets in New Zealand have two different flushers. Nobody knows for sure what they do. Most people just push both of them. This one supposedly. In theory, this one's supposed to flush a little less than this one. But when you push both of them, you get a gigantic flush. That's for the big ones. For the big turns. Yeah. Well, someone peed. Let's see, if it, let's see if it goes backwards in New Zealand. Nope, straight down. Just goes straight down. Backwards. Sinks are backwards. Right. Oh, yeah, this is hot. hot. Left is Left cold. is cold. That's strange. Weird. Why do they have to do that? Mm -hmm. Why is everything have to be backwards? You have to drive on the wrong side of the road. You have to turn the light switch upside down. You have to flush the toilet straight down. With two options. You have to burn your hands because you think you have cold water. Look what else they have. <laughs> See another one? Yeah. Can we do the, um... Little switches for the plugs. 
Totally new. <laughs> Every plug? Yep. That's right. Hold on, we're filming. Hey, Georgie. Now we're gonna get Georgie, mom and dad in there on the picture. Georgie. Mom and dad. Mom and dad. Okay. Jesse. Time again. This time with grandma and grandpa. Oh, George. Look out for the poop, George. George. Don't sit on the poop. It's George, grandpa. need one more. George, come on. George, come see grandpa. He wants you to stand in front of him. All right, whatever. Bye, no, George. Look out, Jesse. Oh. Good boy. Okay, beautiful. The whole Stamper clan. That's looking good. Okay, say proud to be a Stamper. Proud to be a redneck. <laughs> Chinese restaurant eating fried rice, soaking up soy sauce. A zodiac for my Placemat gets me wandering. I'll play guitar and sing, live in my dream. So when the doctor tells me that I am dying, at least. Just maybe I'll die happy Knowing that I have lived passionately
Well, that didn't answer our question, now did it?